Hello, calculus fans. All right, let's find the area of the region bounded by the parabolas y equals 6x minus x squared and y equals x squared minus 2x. Let's go ahead and look at the graphs of these curves. It might be a good idea for you to put the graphs on your calculator so that you can follow along with this. All right, so here's the picture. Notice that y equals 6x minus x squared is the top curve at least between these two intersection points. So we actually need to find the x-coordinates of these intersection points. So we'll do this by setting the functions equal to each other. That is, we're going to set 6x minus x squared equal to x squared minus 2x. And we'll solve for x. we put everything to one side, we'll have 8x minus 2x squared equals 0. Factoring out the 2x, we'll get 2x times 4 minus x equals 0. And that tells us that x equals 0 and x equals 4. If you go back to the picture, that gives us those intersection points. And actually, that's going to give us bounds for our integral. So we can write down an integral for the area. It should look like this. So what we're doing here is we're integrating. This is the top curve. And this is the bottom curve. We always do top minus bottom. And then the 0 to 4, that's because those are the bounds on where the region is. So x equals 4, we got that from the intersection point. That's the rightmost bound on the integral. And then 0 will be the lower limit. OK, if we put this together, clean it all up, integral from 0 to 4 of 8x minus 2x squared. All right, this is a pretty easy integral to evaluate. We just get 4x squared minus 2 thirds x cubed. That's evaluated from 0 to 4. Plug in the 0 to 4, and we get 64 minus 128 over 3. And final answer will be 64 thirds. So that's the area that we want. OK, that's all for now.